Hi guys, Venia Speaks Tech and just before going to bed I got this the OnePlus Open Beta 5 for the OnePlus 7 so apparently it's a very small incremental update I got it just OTA or OTA over the air Open Beta 5 for the OnePlus 7. So apparently it's a very small incremental update. I got it just OTA or OTA over the air. So optimized adaptive brightness, optimized touch, touch, optimized touch experience while playing games, fix the navigation bar color under dark mode, added privacy alerts for the applications with the permissions access to camera location, etc. Improved the stability and fixed known issues weather, improve stability and fix their own issues, emergency rescue, optimize the functionality to improve port experience. So guys, there is a very small incremental update of the Open Beta 4, the Open Beta 5. So let's just press download and install it. And with that said, and no further ado, I am presenting to you the OnePlus 7, OnePlus 7T, the Oxygen OS Open Beta 5. It is a very small incremental update there are not a lot of things that I can show you guys hands-on, but I just hope that the optimized adaptive brightness will bring really some enhancement because really the brightness or the auto brightness was not so good guys compared to what we had really in Android 9 or Android Pie. When we got the Android Q or the Android 10, the adaptive brightness sometimes is so aggressive that it's hardly to see anything when you're in a very dark area. And contrary to that, when it's very bright, I think it's rather like, okay, maybe the problem is just when you are in a very dark area that you are not able to see a lot of things because it is very, very aggressive, all right? So with that said, I just hope that this is gonna be improved. The optimized touch experience while playing games. I am not really a big game player, but I never had problems while I was testing PUBG Mobile or I was testing Call of Duty. Fixing the navigation bar color under the dark mode. I also didn't notice any issues with that, guys. You know I've done a video about disabling the black bar that you have on your keyboard. If you want to do this, you can do this straight away with ADB and of course no root required. Added privacy alerts for the applications with the permission access to camera location, etc. This is a, indeed a very nice feature of Android 10 where you can really add location access to each application, but not only on application basis like just zero enabled or one disabled or vice versa. You can indeed give location use of an application only when this application is active which pretty much i like it um weather okay improved stability and etc emergency rescue now i've heard some things about this like running the phone putting the phone in, in into the ideal mode i have to see how this works so as i'm having this kind of like a short chat with you guys i am already updating the system and i hope that my phone is going to reboot and that everything is gonna work like a charm. So I have to tell you something, guys, not related to the Open Beta 5, but yesterday I decided to reset my phone. I was using Android 9 or Android Pie, then I upgraded to Android 10, which was the first Oxygen OS stable, like 10.0.0, then I updated to 10.0.1, and then of course I went to Open Beta, I'm just pressing reboot by the way and when that happened guys I just wanted to install really straight away like directly 10 from a fat boot ROM long story short I end up fucking and messing up my Google Pay it wasn't working you know with my Revolut card so I will maybe make another video about that how I managed to fix this right now I am running the open weather 4 everything works my bootloader is locked I have no root whatsoever I have installed the open beta 5 on my OnePlus 7 and I'm rebooting the device and let's see all right I just hope that this is gonna go smooth and without any problems for me at the end of the day it is what it is now oxygen OS is being pushed to the open beta 5 still I'm looking for some improvement guys I'm not happy with the way my Bluetooth performs I'm using a Jabra Elite 45 E45 I have a lot of problems also I'm not happy with the voltage support I made a video how you can enable Volta if you're running like on a European carrier. I already tested with some of the guys in other countries. It does work in India, but it doesn't really work, let's say in Saudi Arabia. So we still have to see and wait about that. At the end of the day, it is what it is. So, okay, let's just see what we have here. 
I just updated my phone guys so if I go to the settings and I go about phone and it's quite interesting you see here I have a notification that apparently I have a new system but okay now it's gone and if I go to system updates I can see that I'm already running OnePlus 7. Open Beta 5. I don't see any problem why not jumping on the Open Beta 5. Venia Speaks Tech. Out. Oh, oh.